To all who shall see these presents, greetings. Ruckdog here with my first YouTube video in quite a while, actually. This is going to be just a quick channel update, sort of an overview of a few different topics. Happy Halloween to those of you who are watching this on Halloween when I recorded and uploaded this. I want to try and talk about a little bit of where I've been for the last few months. I want to discuss some of the topics that I've got on tap, sort of floating around in my head for videos coming up here in the future. And I also want to briefly discuss my goals for future updates and how frequently I hope to get videos posted. So the reason for my extended absence from YouTube here has been that I was deployed on the USS Harry S. Truman. CVN 75. This picture here was taken during one of our port visits to Palma de Mallorca. Now you can see the ship there in the distance and some nice palm trees in the foreground. Palma de Mallorca is a very pretty place. If you ever get the chance to go, I do recommend it. All right, so now that I'm back, what do we want to talk about? Well, I want to start off by saying that I feel like I might have painted myself into a little bit of a corner here on the Man Battle Station's YouTube channel. A good chunk of my recent videos, i.e. the last four or five or so that I've uploaded to the website, have been focused on dystopian wars. And I have a little bit of a concern that many of you who have subscribed to my channel recently might have gotten the impression that this channel was going to be and is a dystopian wars centric channel. And while it is true that I play and enjoy dystopian wars, and I do intend to discuss it on the channel in the future, it wasn't always the plan for it to be dystopian wars only. In fact, <laughs> I've always wanted to try and continue to branch out and do things like making videos based on the MBS podcast, doing some tabletop game overviews for other naval games that I play and enjoy. These types of videos would be more or less a tabletop let's play, setting up and maybe going through a single game turn, maybe discussing the models or some of the qualities of the rules for that particular game that I enjoy, and so forth. I also want to get back and do a few unboxing videos for some naval games and naval miniatures especially. I also have it in my head that I would like to go back into my collection of naval games and pull out some of the oldies but goodies and do game retrospectives. And these could be everything from well-known games like, say, Battlefleet Gothic, all the way out to some of the more obscure ones out there that, you know, maybe haven't gotten as much attention or as much play amongst the gaming community. And then finally, one thing that I have kind of been inspired by some other YouTubers to maybe try and dip my toes into is to have some discussions of real-world naval matters, whether it be technology, fleet construction, Maybe going back to history, I am, as you might expect, a fan of naval history. And I just want to try and flex my muscles a little bit in that area here on YouTube and see what comes out of it. See if there's anything in there that other folks might want to watch and or listen to. Now, that being said, uh, this is not an exhaustive list of topics. There are other topics that I'm sure will crop up onto the channel from time to time. And I'm also very much interested in feedback from the viewers of my channel. If there's anything you want me to see talk about uh, or hear talked about on the YouTube channel, please let me know. I am definitely interested in what you have to say about all of that. All right, so that brings me to the point about the update schedule. So obviously my schedule has been relatively slow, even without the five-month deployment hiatus. Uh, I wasn't exactly the most prolific YouTuber up to that point. So what I'm hoping to do is get videos out more regularly, if nothing else. I would like to get one out at least every month. And maybe sometimes there'll be more than once a month. Maybe sometimes it'll be a little bit less. But in general, on average, I want to try and get to about once a month uh, and no less for the uh, channel here. And so that might mean that... Overall, in the course of a year, I get 12 videos out, even though maybe there might be a month or two where I don't get any videos out just because of real life and other events have to deal with all that kind of stuff. <laughs> so anyway, uh, that's about it for this video. I just want to say uh, thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for continuing to support the Man Battle Stations YouTube channel and all the other things we do here at Man Battle Stations, whether it be the forum 
or the podcast or uh, any of our other endeavors. And uh, until I see you then, good luck and good hunting.